question for you. Tony G in the straddle. How much would you pay? Yes. Not to go. To prison? Every single penny that I have and every penny that I could make for the next 10 years, I would pay. For how right, long? It's a year. I wouldn't go to jail for six months. Right. I mean, I can't think of a... He would never make it. I would do fine, okay? No, no. Fit for raises with suited connectors. I have money and I can get coffee, I can trade cigarettes, I can do all that stuff. But you're a brat. I'm a brat. You need a lot of things. In jail, I might be quiet. I'd be like, is this vegan? <laughs> I'm just going to let that sit. So, uh, Viffer raised. <laughs> He's Jack with the cannon. I need three vegan meals a day in prison. I'm sure the vegan meals and the highlights will really win over the cellmates. <laughs> Gonzo calls. Over to Sura. Couple of jacks. He should be able to play this one. Call or re-raise would be fine. Yeah, he's playing. And he calls. Look at this part. I mean, this is okay. tremendous. Daniel Foles. I hope I have, a, like, a qualifying hand. I didn't need much to have a qualifying hand. Seaver Folds. Ace, queen of diamonds for Tony G. Certainly qualifying. Calls. I have a huge hand. But I'm, I'm forced to play. <laughs> like, I have to respect Wiffa. What do you have behind you? Though? Not much. I'm winning. Oh, is that it? That's it. Four players to the flop. Six, eight, eight, and the Wiffer didn't whiff this time. Wiffer flops trippers. Tony G with the nut flush draw. He checks. Wiffer's pretty short going into this hand. Seven. Seven thousand. But Wiffer's in a great spot since he was the preflop aggressor and he connected with this board so huge. Cannon's out. Bobby Sura could be in trouble since two jacks will be the best hand often enough on this board. Then again, he never really was known for his J's. He's singing now because he's winning. And he calls 7,000. <laughs> Tony G probably can't fold. It's pretty tough to give Viffer credit for a hand, and he's unlikely to be drawing dead, though he may be concerned with what got Bobby Sura to open the purse strings. If the board weren't paired, this would probably be an auto check raise. What a hand. What do you have there? Little over 28. He's got no orange chips there. You took them all. 30, so it's like 36. Didn't you hear Stapes? It's a little over 28. Bobby Sura. What are you doing there in that hand? <laughs> Quietly just calling? Good question. <laughs> I've been trying to figure it out myself. He's got like two nines. Basically. You're too good at this game. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop it. This is a big lay down. What are you doing here? I don't, I this don't think a, I can condone like, this. You plan. could never imagine, but don't, don't ever tell anyone. Yeah. yeah. Tony holding? G has Scott fold for him. Tony G makes a pretty tight lay down. We're gonna have to pull his maniac card to the turn. Nine of hearts. <laughs> Two nines. I knew it. You killed my action. I'm all in. Viffer's all in for over 28,000. Oh, I should have re-raised before the flop. Smells like someone has jacks. You got it. Like someone has did. jacks, I think. <laughs> now, Bobby's getting less than two to one, and it's possible Viffer would do this with a draw, but he knows Bobby's been playing tighter than an Ed Hardy t-shirt. <laughs> Next good. If Sura does call, Viffer will almost certainly double up. Oh, I hate to see this one on TV, too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he pulled Dylan, it. muck that hand. Sura makes a good lay down. In this case, tight is right. We're about to, we're going to see it real soon, anyways. Show us one time. Do you want to see? Sure. We're going to see I, it. Here's what I'll tell you. I'll tell you the truth. You're either way ahead or way behind. <laughs> Not way ahead. How can Jax ever be way ahead? He could be way ahead or way behind. Your verbiage yeah. was definitely inaccurate. All right, I'm not very edumacated. Uh, English only at the table, sir. You want to? <laughs>